They come in the middle of the night looking for an easy score. And sometimes they're getting it, but almost every time cameras are watching. Tessa DiTiro reports tonight from Hebron with a story you'll see only here on Local 12. This surveillance video sent to us by the homeowner shows the latest attempt at theft in Orchard Estates. A boy checks the white pickup and the gray SUV for unlocked doors and looks inside with a flashlight. He moves on from these cars on Sugarberry Drive, but George Hilgen says his car was not so lucky. I was missing a custom pocket knife from a wedding. All my quarters were gone, CDs were gone, stuff was destroyed. So I checked the wife's car. Her car had nothing out of it, but they took everything that was in the car and scattered it. After being hit by the thieves three times, Nick Reeser says he installed this security camera. It alerts him on the spot on his cell phone of any movement outside his house. In November, Nick says thieves took a 9 millimeter handgun out of his truck one street over. This last hit, they left this backpack inside his car. You can see that backpack being used in this picture. I'm furious. You have no idea. I mean, once my family gets upset, that's a whole other story. George says his daughter can't sleep at night. All right. Okay. <laughs> I just that's want to say kind of it's phone. This one thing to mess with the adults. You know, we can take a little better, but you get 12, 13 meals out here. You know, they're not sleeping at night. At their wits end, neighbors are ready to take matters into their own hands. If you come back on here and you're armed and dangerous, I have full responsibility to do what I need to do to protect my family. In Boone County, Tessa DiTiro, Local 12 News.